Hello, my name is Liesl. Oh, the frustration. Remember that awesome design that you created and oh, now you can't find it anywhere. This is one of the frequent complaints I receive when speaking to other users about the Canva design tool. So today, I'm going to show you how to bring some order to your Canva files with some best practice tips so that you can easily find your design work and streamline your design life. If this is what you've been looking for, come with me. Okay, let me show you by example. So I've created this Instagram story. We've got Motivation Monday, Terrific Tuesday, Wonderful Wednesday. Okay, if I don't change the names on this design, what we will see is if I go to my Canva front page, go down to recent designs, I will see that there's a story and it just took the first word that was part of the story, which is terrific. Okay, so if I would now try and search for any of this, it will only come up if I search by the word terrific. Okay, but that word might not be in your design anymore. For example, if you um, used a template in Canva and originally it had the word girl boss in there, but now you've changed it and you actually forgot that it was a girl boss um, template, you will struggle to find it again. Okay, so let's go back to our design. So let's first rename our pages so we can, for example, say Insta story. So the more information you put in there, the easier it would be for you to find it in future. And let's put in motivation Monday. Okay, now it is a little bit difficult to read it up here. So I will show you another way just now before we continue with Tuesday. If you come down here to the grid view and you click on there, your design will actually come up in this format. So it's easier to rename it here. So let's click there and we go Insta Story Terrific Tuesday. Let's quickly do this one. Wednesday, and if I wanted to add a page, I can do it here as well. Okay, so this is your first step. You name your individual designs. Then when you go up here to file, there's a little edit pen again. So go and change that to whatever you want to call your series. So this is my Insta stories. Um, weekly motivation motivations okay and we save that so now we've saved it in two places first the individual designs and also the file now you can do it in a third way you can come here down to save to folder and here you can either create a folder if if you don't have one as yet so to do that you can go down to create new and type in your folder name and go add to new or i will just um, put it to one of the folders that i've got already so i want to put it to the va wonder social media post so i will put it in there and save okay so now i've given myself three chances to find it by naming the individual artwork by naming the design and by putting it into a folder. Okay, let's go see what this looks like. So say we go back to the front. And if I look at this latest story that I've been working on, I can see it says Insta story, weekly motivation. It is a story and I've also put it within my VA Wonder social media posts. Okay, so this little gray block down here will actually be the folder name. See what happens when we download this. So I will go to share, download, JPEG, and download. I will now find this file within my downloads. So let's go there. And when I extract the file, I can see that all the individual pages kept their names. So now it's easy for me to use and find on my computer as well.
Oh, but Liesl, tell me, where do I find it? Well, let me show you. When we go to the front page of Canva, it will say, search your content or canvas right here. Okay, so as soon as you start searching, so let's say motivation, you can either choose templates. So for example, um, motivational quotes and things from Canva will come up, or you can go to projects and these are your projects. So click onto that. And then all your project projects where the word motivation is in will actually start popping up. And here's the first one. You can recognize that from the design that we've done earlier. So if I click onto it, I will find my design. Or you can go back to the front page again. We can scroll down and then you will see your recent designs that you've worked on. Or you can click on this hamburger menu you can go down here to pro projects and then you can either have all your projects here the folders that you've created the designs that you've just worked on or images that you've uploaded also if you click on here you can go to your different folders your designs your images or videos that you've created I hope this quick video will help you today to find and organize your Canva files much easier. I hope you found this helpful. I hope you learned something new today. And if there's anything else that you would like to know, please leave me a message below. Thank you and bye-bye.